Hey guys, it's Ta. Welcome back. So, today is November 1st. I hope you guys had a great trick-or-treating um, night last night. We we got a good bit of candy. We had a good time. Uh, we went to the little haunted uh, yard that we have here with the maids. It was super fun. So, today, I am going to show you what I have so far for my toy donations that I will be doing when it gets a little bit closer to Christmas. Uh, we have an organization in here. It's called Pay It Forward. It's a building that is run by volunteers. The only thing they profit on is they sell stuff in the store to pay, um, I'm assuming like rent or utilities or something like that. But nobody gets paid to work there. Super cool place. You can go in there and get clothes for 10 cents. Even less than that, depending on what day you go. There's tons of stuff for free. And when it comes to holidays, they do a toy drive. They do a canned good drive for like Thanksgiving. They're, uh, they've done Easter things. They've done Valentine's things. And uniforms and school supplies. We do all that. That way you can sign up. And we have like there's an application process or whatever you sign up and you put on there you know what children you have or or what your family consists of and then you get toys that people have donated also they are currently running a football pool to pay for some of the toys that they might not get in the toy drive but I I try to give to it and this year I have a lot so far so I don't know how much more I'm actually gonna get but I'm kind of going to skim through what I do have. A lot of this you've seen already. But I just kind of wanted to show you guys. So these I got this week. And I also got this one. These were 50 cents, 90% off at Dollar General. I have 19 of these to donate to the toy drive. And then I found these last minute. Like two days ago when I went back to the DG. They are the Play-Doh. These were 10 cents. I have three of those. Somebody, uh, they were hiding behind a stack of stuff. So apparently somebody hit them waiting for them to be a penny. But it took them. This was something from last year or maybe early this year. It was 90% off. It's a double dutch rope set. Some little girl would probably like to get that. I found this the other day. The golf set. And it was 60 cents. Just a little frisbee that was 10 cents. Um, this I found at Walmart two days ago. This is the mermaid set. It's a three piece set. It comes with a bikini top, a bikini bottom, and a mermaid tail. This is a size 9 to 12, medium large. It was on clearance for $2.25. So not a bad deal. And I want to say this was upwards of like 15 or 19 bucks. So that's a good deal for that. Uh, what else? Some more couch. Oh, this plane, this launcher, this one was 50 cents. And everything else on the couch is these. Then let's get into my bins. I have two big bins. So I've had this Play Doh set. I'm not, I'm not sure where this came from. This might have been Walgreens or something. The majority of what I'm showing you is 75 to 90% off. It just depends on where it was at. Then I found these summer buckets that I forgot I had. They were Dollar General. They were 40 cents and they are collapsible. So I have three of those to put in there. Um, two balloon water bomb launchers. These were 90% off, so 40 cents each. I found this bird at Walgreens. I bought multiples, but for a dollar, it sings 58 melodies. Uh, we tweet, we sing, we move. It's actually a multi-series uh, selection. One, two, three, four, five, six. There's six of them you can collect, and a series four is the only, this one, like I said, I bought two like this, and one other color, but I gave that to Abby. Then, this was another DG. 50% off and some of the things in here I did get for a penny I just don't know which ones let's see this dory set Dollar General and it's the modeling clay and it comes with everything you need to do 
Hank and Dory and possibly and Nemo too and maybe even the whale what's the whale's name not destiny but the other one I think I don't know I don't remember names I have this color works marker set I want to say these were Walmart and then CVS at one point I got all of these soft packs of play-doh for really cheap so I have four of those probably a few more in here but definitely four these were DG 90% off a little pool and also a slip and slide Let's see. this marble game and then this was wags I remember that from Walgreens it's a little bracelet kit these were Dollar General. It is the art sets. You get 12 crayons, one pencil, one brush, one sharpener, six color pencils, 12 watercolors, and one mixing tray. I have the Minions and then the Lisa Frank. Because who doesn't like Lisa Frank, especially us 90s kids? Then Walgreens was the crystal growing set. Dollar General. Minions bathtub. Uh, scribblers i'm assuming maybe it's not bathtub one activity pad four crayon toppers one markers two sticker sheets 49 foam pieces two stencils and a glue tube so no not bathtub not bathtub there is the uh that's what it all looks like this was walmart and it was not seven dollars it is the minions uh play-doh set what else? Oh, another crystal set. Bubbles. Walgreens, I think. Um, what else is in here? Some princess dress up, some lip gloss. Magnetic sheets where you dress them. Uh, this was Rite Aid before it shut down. What else? Uh, some of this, I think this is part of it I got from Easter baskets that I broke down so that was something from there a play-doh uh, mr. potato head mrs. potato head PJ mask puzzles in the lunchbox tin and then Revan wheels truck set got two of those let me put some of this back in And then in the next container, some more pieces from breaking down uh, Easter baskets. I have this weaving loom. This was Walgreens, I remember it. It is the, you make the shapes and then you iron it down and it makes the uh, plastic like keychain type things. Kids love those. And then these were last week, DG, 90% off. This was DG. Um, it is the Loom Rubber Band Bracelet Maker. And then I went to Walmart a while back and I found packs of rubber bands that I will include. I found a brown, a black, and a red, so they get extra rubber bands that way. Um, style my way at 48 adhesive nail stickers and you make them yourself here's a bigger picture of it and I think these glow yeah glow nail glow in the dark so that'll be fun for some little girl this 236 piece block set block tech set Some of the summer toys with the ball with the uh, Velcro piece. And I have three of these art sets I got from DG. I want to say 90% off as well. If not a penny. Um, these paracord cuffs. It's... make your own paracord bracelets 
Each of the girls got one last year, but I still had another one. Um, these were from CVS. They are prank fun. I want to say they came out somewhere around springtime to kind of do with April Fool's Day. I have three of those to give. And then these were also CVS. They are the Disney Foam Sticker Activity Packs. Eight paper scenes, one foam sticker sheet, and 104 foam stickers. These were 90% off, so they were 49 cents a piece, and I have four of them. Oh, uh, what else? Oh, these have these stickers. They are by Crayola, the foam stickers. These were a penny a pack. And there are multiple, I have multiple packs of them. They're all the same. And I got these mustaches. Maybe somebody can have fun with that. Those were a penny. Oh, more stickers. These were DG as well. And they are the Avengers hand sanitizers. You get seven, um, yeah, no, six hand sanitizers and one container to put them in, like to hang it on your backpack. So I have three packs of those. And this was part of an Easter basket that was broken up. These were Walmart exclusive, I think. Yeah, Walmart exclusive. My little pet shop. I want to say these were, I don't know, a quarter maybe. This was part of an Easter basket. As well as this. And then this was Walmart. It's a brick head Lego, ages 10 and up. It is the beast. And it was not $5. It was way less than that. I want to say it was like a dollar. So somebody will have fun with these. Um, and the last thing that so far that I have is this sit and play activity tray with My Little Pony. It is 15 pages, activity pad, a pair of scissors, 8 markers, 2 stencils, 2 sticker sheets, 8 crayons, and 1 glitter glue. So, that is everything I have so far that I'm going to be donating for Christmas and I cannot wait. I absolutely love that time of the year. Basically from November 1st on through December 31st. It's my favorite time of year. I like to give so this gives me an excuse to go shopping to give things to less fortunate. Um, I know not all kids can you know get a, a great great Christmas but all kids deserve a great Christmas, and that's just how I look at it. So, if it means me going stock stores at 90% off or 75% off, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make sure every kid that is in this area gets a Christmas worth waking up for. And I, I know, like, a lot of kids don't expect it, but I want them to feel special. I want them to have that. So, that's why I do this. Um... If you hear of any great deals, let me know because I would gladly add to this to give to them because, like I say, out of everything that I've bought on clearance, I've maybe taken 10, maybe 12 items out. I'd say about a dozen items out to give to my family members, like the little kids. Everything else goes in these buckets and the stuff inside of the buckets will be donated. I just need my buckets back. Because I got to fill them up for next year. And I do this all year long. I will put stuff together. I have a, a room that's specifically full of boxes. And these go in there. And at the end of the year when it's time to dump them out. I gladly bring them. Also this month we're doing a can go drive. So I will be loading up for that. Not only is it for putting baskets together for the less fortunate for Thanksgiving time. It's also a chance for the girls in Abby's dance class. Whoever collects the most, they win a pizza party. So why not kill two birds with one stone and get them a pizza party and help the less fortunate. So that is all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, if you have any ways that you give back, let me know in the comments below. Maybe there's something I'm missing and I could hit on that and, and run with it and have an even better haul 
to give the kids something different, you know? If you are new, welcome. I hope you enjoyed this enough to hit that subscribe button and the like button. Stick around and see what else I have because this channel we do a lot and this is just a portion of it. Um, also, if you click back two, three videos, I am going to be doing a Christmas card exchange. If you watch that video, you will see all the details on that um, and what to do. I'm looking for, right now. I'm looking for ideas on types of gift cards and who would be interested in doing it before I actually set up the date to start mailing everything out. So, if you are returning, thank you for coming back. I hope you enjoyed this as well. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.